Chinese and Israeli scientists and business people met last week at a renewable energy conference in Jerusalem to talk about how the two countries can share alternative energy technology. China is uh, a global power already now and for sure is going to be even stronger in the, in the near future. Uh, from the Israeli side, we look at this cooperation as a strategic uh, cooperation and we look at China as, as a very important partner for us. China's innovative and industrial capabilities are of interest to Israel scientists. The two countries already collaborate in the solar industry. Israeli companies are currently providing technology to swap out China's boiler system for solar water heaters that raise efficiency and reduce pollution. I bring uh, to Israel, I think, uh, maybe the information about uh, what's the China's problem, uh, particularly the energy problem, the climate change problem, and uh, what kind of solutions we are, we are, uh, we are, what kind of solutions they are thinking, and, and also what's the uh, China's needs. Another renewable energy field connecting China and Israel is solid waste recycle. This plant processes thousands of tons of waste per day, recycling 70 to 80 percent of the trash coming in from Israel's central plain. The trash is dumped, separated, and compressed in a closed system that filters out inorganic and organic materials that are then either reused to make new plastic, glass, paper, and even clothing items, or processed to generate electricity. The system is unique because garbage doesn't have to be pre-sorted. All of it goes into the vats at the same time. The technology is today is known as probably the most advanced technology around the world. And the issue is we are the first technology who can actually treat a mixed municipal solid waste. We do not need pre-separation at home. The recycle system is being implemented outside of Israel for environmental as well as monetary gain. A ton of recycled waste can fetch as much as 250 U.S. dollars in some countries. Most recently, South America, Europe, the U.S., and a private concern in China's Hebe province have signed on for this system to be built and manned by Israeli engineers. It's companies like these that are the force behind this renewable energy conference. Israel has the technology, China's buying it. Both stand to gain by making a profit with reusable waste and also by cleaning up the environment. Stephanie Freed for CCTV in Tel Aviv.